Greetings and salutations, I am Keb. Welcome back to this Let's Play OU4 as Congo, where we are. Ooh, suffering attrition. And more attrition, and some more attrition, and we're never gonna have manpower. Because that just doesn't happen to, to Congo. Oh boy. Manpower, what's that? I mean, we get event that reduces manpower, that's what we get. <laughs> So now you're down there, and you're trying to kill him, probably, yeah. That's your siege stack, and you have a kill stack over there. Molly being defensive is just so painful. But there's nothing we can do about it. So I'm trying now to spare my manpower as much as possible. I think we're gonna switch around a bit. Uh, we can have another admin tech. Yes. Gonna have to do that. Another idea group. Which is nice, but not that we have any. Yeah, what are we gonna go for? What are we gonna go for? So there are a few that could help us. We don't have we don't have the manpower, the points to go for any of these, sadly. I mean, those would would have been awesome, really, but it's too late now. And we already have a military idea. If we ever get the points, we can flush that out. That leaves trade. So let's see, our air is a 344, our current guy is a 236. We're also, so we're gonna have lots of military points. We're gonna have a fair bit of diplomatic points. We are gonna be integrating some very large vassals soon. So that kind of makes this one more appealing. Slightly more appealing. Though the way things are going, you might even need diplomatic just so we can truce break and get this done in time. Or we can push for quantity. And just see if we can get more manpower, because we're always short of manpower. So yeah, either influence, so I can spread out the points right now, or quantity, so I can push to these two. Uh, manpower and more recovery speed right away. Heck, even defensive would be good, because then we at least could attrition the enemy before. We're also gonna need offensive for the sieges, but that's not gonna happen anytime soon. Is it worth it, though? This, and then several hundred points. I think we're gonna have to. If we're ever gonna have enough manpower to deal with the Ottomans. And aggressive expansion isn't really a problem, to be honest. We <laughs> so it's only the diplomatization cost. Save ourselves some bird mana. Yeah, we probably wouldn't get much out of that. Oh, institution spread would be nice. And of course we could even double up on the administration cost. Uh, if I go there, what ideas do I get? I get one for recovery speed, which I desperately need. I'm gonna go quantity, I'm gonna do that. We're still gonna get the next tech here, the Gustavians. And once the next unit, that's level 23, so that's gonna take me a long time. Okay, so we're gonna get that for the tactics, and then we're gonna push into the idea group here to get these two uh, manpower numbers, at the very least. I might even have to switch over. 
No, I can't switch over. I'm still way behind on admin points, so I need to keep doing that. For now. Yeah, okay, well... I'm gonna stick with this, I suppose. Um, This army is almost depleted. I'm gonna leave the artillery behind. The rest of you... You know what? Consolidate, because there's nothing left in you. And move out. Yeah. Still gonna give three siege from you guys, from you and one from artillery. Yeah, that's fine. If I were lucky, Mali would go and kill his separatists, but I don't think he's gonna care to do that at all. I'll see. A lot of mercs and one, yeah, that's what I want there. You probably gonna have to consolidate here as well. Um, I'm gonna do a more selective consolidate here, I think. Um, You. Okay. There. Seems better. So, Mali manpower, how are you doing there? You have no manpower now. Thank God, so at least we are in the same situation there. So his armies can't get any larger. And we are, of course, pretty much relying on mercs. I would love to be able to kill one of his stacks, because he has way more artillery than we do. Way more. Speaking of, that might actually be... Yeah, we can't even afford it because we don't have manpower. Never mind. Um, how much actually do we have? We have three in total. Well, these separatists are just going to be an absolute nuisance, out there, aren't they? Well, if he's not going to kill his uh, rebels, I suppose we'll have to do it. Ugh. I really would like this to fall so I can move my troops all the way around here. France declares war on Pima. Pima, Pima, yeah, that's somewhere up here, I think. Defensive planner with tons of artillery. I would love to go down and help that siege, but I just... no. Ain't gonna happen. Uh, of course. Ooh, they had troops there. I must go kill. That's what the AI suddenly realized. Rebels must kill. Everybody must kill the human. Grr! <laughs> ah. Okay, we'll have to see if we can somehow save that battle. At least it's our terrain. You know what, let's... Let's end this charade, it's time. We need more troops. Oh! So you're telling me I can't recruit up here? Liar. Gonna take a lot, all the loans I need. This is gonna end in our favor. You... Consolidate everything. Take the cannon out. 
and send them up there. Works out. Troops back there. Oh! So you're telling me he pretty much wiped out all my mercs. Ain't that ground. Okay, we're gonna keep trading more troops. Probably down in the safety of Africa now. What? Didn't I tell you to... Oh. Need money. Do we now? Um... Hmm, what's gonna be more costly? Fighting corruption or getting a loan? We already have bookkeeping, so I'm thinking I'm gonna go with the loans. And we have lots of war exhaustion, gonna buy that down. Why do you do this? This irks me. Suddenly. Oh, we're gonna build everything in one province, because why should the macro builder be, be smart? Twenty more mercs. Keep fighting this war until I win. Grr. Of course, now he's gonna come up and kill me because I lost 30k troops. Great Karu is already done. Wow. Fall! Fall! Ugh. Wait, are you telling me I'm getting attrition here as well? Apparently, yeah. And I can't move from here because... Fort. Yeah. Break, catch, cannot. And you can't move either because of the fort rule. Fall, damn you. Once this falls, they're all of them are gonna go straight for Timbuktu and unseat that. And then I'm gonna go around the north, I think. We'll have to see what we can do here. If I could kill one of his stacks, that would be so, so helpful. But, yeah. It's AI. AI invincible. So you can't move out, and you'll just stand there at attrition, which is terrible. Are the mercs here finally done? Good. Go. On the bright side, he's at least attritioning troops down there. They got pretend rebels, how nice. How long has this war been going now? Seven years. Siege of Tarsa is done, finally. It's his last naval uh, area. You're gonna move all the way up there. And we're gonna consolidate all the mercs first. 
And you're just gonna sit right there. Yes, we have to keep raising more taxes because this war ain't gonna ain't gonna end anytime soon. Thousand infantry under his nose. Could they do it? Probably not. I mean, he's a good general. The casualty numbers so far: hundred sixty thousand. <laughs> yeah, two hundred thousand have died fighting this war. So far. So far. I think he's seeing the picture too. He's moving closer to the war goal. Let's move in small increments here. Well, I admit I'm tempting right now to just tempted right now to just see if I could do him some harm. Didn't I send the Fluids down here. Well, there you are. That's not where you're supposed to be. Okay, revolt. Where? Makwans. 2.5. You are being converted, I believe. That's going to be done in May. Okay, so that revolt should go away. Unless I'm super unlucky on the roll, te roll text there. That wouldn't be... That would never happen, would it? No. Me being unlucky with rolls. That's never happened before. Uh, try to move so you don't attrition yourself, please. Yes, of course I needed more, weaker morale, because, hey, I'm not in a war or anything. Okay, I'm gonna send my troops up here. And I just might consider fighting him. I would take the disembarkment penalty, I believe. This next tick is gonna be in 19 days. Ships are, are not gonna be there in time, so that's gonna fall now. Almost certainly. You are going to Honmuri, you're moving away. Which is great news. You know what? Let's let's give it a gamble. It's gonna fall in four days. You're gonna arrive in four days. <laughs> what do you think will happen? This is gonna fall, and I'm gonna be there, and I'm gonna get defensive. Yeah, that's what's gonna happen. This is gonna fall right now, and then I'm gonna be fighting. Not only a short penalty, and I'm gonna be fighting because I'm landing in a jungle. I'm almost certain of this. Let's try anyway, I want to see it happen. So I just, I just want to see, does the siege revolve first, uh, resolve first, or does movement resolve first? Because the date is the same. So, 16. Okay, movement first, before siege. So we got there just in time for that. And we give him a terrain penalty. I do not get a disembarkment penalty, excellent. Of course he has a good leader and Artillery and cavalry. All I have are mercs, so yeah. That's by no means a given. No means a given result. Speaking of, let's 
see if we can influence the result. All the mercs I could possibly buy. Ha! Fought him back. Excellent. Now we're gonna do, do the same thing that the AI likes to do. I think it's gonna be okay. Not sure where the hell his other army went, but it's not anywhere near me, so... Let's quickly split up our forces. You can go there. You just split, 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 split. Actually, don't split this much. to undo all of this and maybe reduce all the war exhaustion we're accumulating. At least we saved the Siege of Benin. That's, that's good. That's good. We actually have enough manpower to build an army. Um, because I can't recruit up there because of Liberty Desire. Um... Sure, get another cannon. So I can have four cannons and do the sieges just a little bit faster. And in any... If anybody oh, was wondering, yes, I am this stubborn. I am incredibly stubborn when it comes to... Uh, these kind of wars. Yeah, you're now marching south. You're gonna try to kill... Uh, you're gonna try to kill these guys, aren't you? Yeah. Okay. Can't risk this then. Everybody return home. And... Cancel construction. And as long as he has this central leader of forts, I can't really deal with him. So, yeah. Unfortunate. Now to secure the war goal. The province of Ya is actually safe, so let's move there. It doesn't have a fort nearby, it, so... Everybody here for the ocean evacuation. Actually... Leave you. Yeah, we are whittling him down, but my goodness. There's 40,000 troops remaining. You're gonna die, Molly. And of course, I'm not exactly in good shape either, but I'll be damned if I'm gonna surrender before I have 100% war score, or at, or at least the ticker. Uh, let's move. Because he's still beelining for us. Now I can move these forces around here, maybe to harass him on the other side. Right, we were supposed to clear out some natives, weren't we?
let's wait right, I want to see where you go next. 28, 29, never turning back, okay. In that case I'm gonna march on you. The cannon is gonna be down 28th of September. It'll take a while. And yeah, that's, that's African warriors, you are gonna go here and pick up these guys. I'm not gonna try anything sneaky with them until I know where its armies end up going. He's going the bug way. He's moving this way. Yeah, he's gonna try to intercept us. Probably. Let's go there and see if we can tempt him to return. To the fort. Colony struck by Roman fever. Ah. Know what? I need my admin points. Yeah, you're gonna have slow growth anyway, so... And the cannon is done. I would love to sneak that cannon up, but right now he's moving his troops to Bagway. So he's kind of dangerous. Let's grab the cannon and leave. Next, Joma and Bure. Yeah, you're gonna start unsieging everything I've done, right? At least that's my expectation. Which is fine. We can do the same thing over here. You're still not marching. Let's see if we can sneak you out. Let's do this at least. I want to see if I can get him up there. And join. Oh no, that immediately decided. Oh no, I'm gonna have to kill you now. You're trying to get away. Can't let that happen. Oh, a spy got kicked out. Boo. It's doing so well, too. Can evacuate our cannon. Can you actually take Vasilization outright? If. Hmm. Yeah, but there's no way I can make him like me, so... No. So that switched over to being a kill stack, and that's now a siege stack. As far as I can tell. I'm gonna send you to Tarsa and try to get a cannon in that way. Suppose I could try to do a kill stack with this. We have enough troops up here anyway. No matter what kind of a loss he takes, it's gonna be his loss, not mine, so. I mean, these are mercs. I 
Well, the wars score ticked around quite effectively, but that's okay. This ain't over yet. Next mill tech. Definitely gonna take that right away. Because now I should get a tech for uh, siege obsolescence. There we go, modified by plus two. And you're marching to Bure next. Yeah, you're gonna go and defend there, aren't you? So, let's see, where are you gonna march next? After Bure, you're gonna march... Nowhere. Uh, I don't want to get myself in the between there. Let's see if I can do that. See if you can undo the massive damage he's done on me up there. Uh, you're still marching to high vault. Oh well. Well, the war is turning, but it's very slow going. I will see. I will break Mali. I'll have to. Uh, but that'll be next time. Thank you for watching.